Dankies. Well, I got one. Size gill. Oh, is that a perch? Look at that thing. That's a large mouth right there. Look at that. Huh? Look at you. What you doing in this little pond? I just couldn't resist. You couldn't resist it, huh? Come on. Get a hook out of you. Get a hook out of you. Keep poking it. Oh, look at you, little large man. You did pretty fishy. Cool. Toss your back. The gill. I like pink today. I like pink today. Ah. Hey, I don't know why I went back. This is mine. Hmm. Large mouth, I think. <laughs> I think it's a large mouth. See the black stripe on them. It is a large mouth. Look at how pretty. Hey, buddy. You can come over here. Look at that. Definitely defined stripe on you, huh? That is awesome. You are pretty. <laughs> Look at you. About you, you've been eating too, huh? Your lips are all red and everything. Look at you. How pretty. Look at that stripe. That is awesome. Yeah. That is awesome. Well, hello, fella. You've been eating? Getting nice and big and fat for the winter. You're the reason I ain't catching no crappy, huh? Look how pretty. Oh, thanks, buddy. Let's snow off your head. Let you go. You go back from whence you came. Gill. Just a gill. They like pink today. I like pink today. Ah. Hey, give me my worm back. Where's mine? <laughs> well, they're still biting. There's a little blue gill there. Hey, Gilly. What's up with you? Aren't you pretty? Ow. I dropped you. Yeet! Back here out at the secret spot. It's a little windy today. Those dead trees fall on me. Because that would be a bummer. Set up today back out here at the spot got my tip gloves on and I learned this little trick from my uncle get some uh, little like EMS gloves 
and put them on because you're gonna to be touching wet fish. It definitely helps keep your hands obviously dry and warm. It's a mid-sized float from Walmart. And I have it set probably about four feet down onto a little ice fishing jig. It's not a dot, but a little pink and white ice fishing jig. And a Berkeley Power Worm kind of acts as a spike. I just pieced it out, took a little part off of it. And they seem to like it. I'll let you know if I catch fish. Break up that ice. Swim. Swim. There you go. Another dank. But, hey. That's fun. Bye, fishy. Yeet. Shaker. A head shaker. I think it's the same darn fish I just caught. No, this one's a lot smaller, huh? Hold on, hold on, hold on. See ya. Thank you, fish. Well, I had to get a thinner piece of this Berkeley Power Worm, this blaze orange Berkeley Power Worm because of the size of the fish. Their little mouths can get around it. So. That's about the standard size for here. Let's see here. Ah, down there. Yeet. It is not a crappy. It is a bigger bluegill. It's a bigger gill, which is good. Whoop, oh, and he just fell off at my foot. Hey, dude, you're big in the water. Whoop. So, this one didn't even hit it. I can't call it a hit. The jig will just fall, and they'll suck it up in their mouths. And not even trigger a response from whoop, not even trigger a response from the float so kind of neat I'll get to you later crap oh I found a crappy look at that huh about damn time Whew. hey buddy the old paper mouth come here if you're wondering why I call them paper mouths you can see this membrane on their lips is about as thin as paper. But they're a beautiful fish. Yeet! All right, found a school of crappy. That's two in a row, two casts in a row. Two crappy. Oh, careful. Hey, I'm trying to help you. Try to hurt you and I try to help you. See, that's, that's a give and take. You, thank you. You're pretty. Boy! Well, it's safe to say the crappy are biting today. That's three in a row. Really light bite. But at least they're hitting the head up, baby. Thank you. Thank you. No keeper sizes, but hey, what the hell. Alright, after a long dry spell, I finally got another fish to hit. Gil! Well, they're still biting. Little blue gill there. Hey, Gilly. What's up with you? Aren't you pretty? Ow. I dropped you. 